I get a lot of questions about how I uh, separate my boosters. So I thought I'm gonna just explain it in a, in a simple video. This is what you need to do. Uh, it works with rubber bands, so it's actually really simple. Um, these are the two engines you need to use. They are different. This is the D12-0, so that means it will burn. And if it is it's burned out, it will shoot a flame out of the top. So this is not uh, for like uh, putting out a parachute. This is to ignite a second engine. This one is D12-3. This one is an engine for your last stage or your second stage, because if this one burned out, then he will explode on the top. So he will push out your parachute. So you will, you need to have them like this in your rocket. First, this one will ignite. It will burn. It will shoot your rocket up. When it's all burned out, he will shoot a flame into the second engine, igniting the second engine. And then you have to make something that this engine will disappear or fall off so that the flame from the second engine, or the second stage, have room to push the rocket. Now, where the, does the rubber bands come in? If you have uh, like a booster, like this is the, the booster engine, you will have them over here. Then you will have to tie the boosters together, two on two, and you will have to make sure the elastic bands are between those two engines. I will explain it better later with my own rocket, but this is just the theory. Of the theory. So what happens? You ignite the first stage with the boosters at the same time, of course. Uh, it's important that the booster engine has a burn time that is equal to this engine. What happens? You ignite it. Um, the first stage will burn and the boosters will burn. They will all push the rocket up. It will burn, 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 burn. When this one is done, he will just uh, explode and shoot out the rocket of the, the parachute of the booster. When this one is done, it will shoot a flame out of the top. By that, it will burn the elastic bands. When the elastic bands are burned, then uh, yeah, they will break, and then your boosters can fall off. And then you will also ignite the second stage. So your boosters fall off, your first stage falls off, and your second stage continues. Now, I will uh, show it with my, with my own rocket that you have a more better idea of how that works. This is the bottom side of the rocket. This is the main engine. These are the two booster engines. Now, I put one rubber band between them. Um, it's better to use more because you really want the boosters to hold on tight. But this is just what happens. Uh, all engines are ignited at the same time. The main engine will burn. When it's done burning, it will shoot a flame. It will burn the elastic bands between the boosters. I, I will show you in a minute. And then you will ignite the second engine. And the second engine is around here. And the second engine will push out this thing. This is the like a, a, a motor house for the first engine. So I will push out this thing, and if we're gonna look in the rocket, then you will see the rubber band that goes right uh, between the two engines, and we have the booster. This is how it works. The elastic band goes around the booster, goes in the hole, 
goes through the rocket and attaches to the other one and that will hold the boosters on place then as soon as the first engine this one will will be burned out it will shoot the flame out of here it will shoot the flame on the rubber bands it will melt the rubber bands so if soon as the rubber bands break then the boosters can fall off and he will ignite the second engine and the second engines because of this this hole the second engine has room to uh, for its for its flame so the rocket is not going to burn up so that's basically how it works so to make it even more clear this is what's happening in the beginning the boosters and the first stage are firing and when they are done the first stage will ignite the second stage the second stage will push out the engine holder that is the first state and it will burn the rubber bands so the boosters will fall off and when the second state is burned out he will explode on the top and push out the parachute so important where are my engines the first state need to be a zero that is uh, to ignite the second stage that's important and the second stage and the booster engines need to have a free can also be a five this is the amount of seconds uh, delay before he explodes if this is the booster then it will fall off and then it will take three seconds before the parachute comes out of the booster if you have uh, like a one over here then it will only take one second and maybe then the booster is still on the rocket and you, you don't want to have that you, they need to be completely separated so always use a three or a five five means five seconds delay before the parachute charge blows i hope it's a little bit clear if you have any questions just uh, ask them in the comments Thank you for watching.